Good morning. I totally forgot that I had this mask on. Good morning, everyone. Today is a very long and busy work day. I thought it'd be interesting to show you guys all the work and preparation and time and people it takes to produce sponsored content. I'm working with Fossil today. This video, as well as some upcoming Instagram stories, Instagram pictures are sponsored by Fossil. You know, we had this conversation a couple days ago on my budget video about uh, sponsored content. So I thought I'd give you a little BTS as to what I do, how I work with photographers and brands and kind of everything that goes into it. All right, here's the Fossil watch we'll be working with today. Um, I'm actually gonna shoot both of these watches today, but this is kind of the main focus. This watch, which is called the Jacqueline watch, is my all-time favorite. I actually wear this all the time lately, ever since I got it. Not only is it a smart watch, so if I wanted to play music, all I would have to do is like, see? Activity progress on the top button, and then you can actually take your photo with the watch if you press this button so I don't know I think that's really cool and it doesn't look like a smart watch it's like a classic watch and I really really like that but uh, you can change around your settings and stuff and the other one that we'll be working with today is the Jocelyn uh, watch we have two totally different vibes of watches today that we are shooting so we need to produce content that really makes the different types of watches shine. It's actually crazy um, how much thought needs to go into these pictures because at the end of the day, you guys just see a picture with the hashtag ad at, at the end of it. But there is a lot of thought and work and people involved in it. So the first time I shot with Fossil, I actually tried to do it myself. But um, cause you guys know I like to shoot um, photos myself using my timer, I did an entire video on it. Uh, you can check the cards above to check it out. But I was having a hard time getting the glare of the watch just right while also taking my own picture. So at the end of the day, I had to ask Brian to help me. And I think the photos actually turned out really, really cute. Um, so today I'm actually gonna ask my uh, photographer friend Grid to come over and help me. Uh, we're gonna shoot not only the fossil watches, but also some other content. A lot happening today. I have two hours to get ready, uh, which may seem like a lot, but I have to, this is a struggle today. I'm going with uh, Brian first, and then we will do the shopping one. And then we will go to, I think there's a Christmas tree up down the street. So we'll do that for a giveaway. And then just like another lifestyle one. Mm -hmm. And That's then, at the same place or around the Christmas tree? I think so. Uh, and then while we're there, I have to go to the grocery store to get stuff for the baking, baking one. And Brian, and then he holds your hand. Yeah, like that. I'm gonna be like angle because it's not gonna make him move around. These are definitely. 30 billion times better. Yeah, that's good. That's what I was doing again. Okay. Uh, Nuki, why are you on mama's clothes? Go. Nuki, Nuki. <laughs> are you? Okay. We've been out of this for almost over an hour. We got two shots done, hopefully. Three more to go. finished everything. I think there's some good ones. There's a lot of good ones. Yeah. <clears throat> For sure a lot of good ones. Especially like the one of you and Brian. Yeah, that was really cute. And the uh, lunch one. The lunch one. The colors are really good in that one. I liked the Christmas tree one too. Oh yeah. That one was really quick. That was cute. That's really good. Now I have to... Look through the photos and then get ready because I have an event. I have to be there at 6. Is that the 29 rooms one? Yeah. So you're still, you're still going? 
I have to go, yeah. Um, so here are some of the pictures. I'm not gonna go too in depth about all of them because I have to edit them and then send them over to all the brands uh, for approval. That's, that's for a giveaway, by the way, so stay tuned on my Instagram. Now I'm gonna choose my favorite pictures now and then edit them. Um, and then after that, and then head over to the event. I get to get I get to go there um, an hour before it actually opens, so I can take my picture, get a get it approved uh, by the team, and then post it. And then um, the only thing after that I have to do is Instagram stories throughout the event. So uh, yeah, I told you a lot of uh, content today, content creation today with partners. So I hope you guys are finding this interesting. Anyways. Let's go to the event. <sighs> All right, well, vlogmas breakdown number one. I'll tell you guys about it later, but fucking 20 minutes late to To this refinery party you know I'm supposed to be working and that makes me look hella unprofessional so not happy right now hi hi sorry I'm That's late okay. you're not late I'm nice not? to see you you guys are all doing plan b right yes yeah. so I'll have someone from the team come back to help you guys too if you need yeah perfect okay. thank you you guys are in this space so here is our installation um so basically we're all here. Hi. To kind of just uh, destigmatize de the use of emergency emergency contraceptives and birth control and all that kind of stuff. So what we have to do is just take a picture in this cute little installation and post it. Sorry, I didn't hang out with you today. I missed you, baby. I missed you, baby. So I know I had a little breakdown in the car on the way to event, uh, the event, but honestly, there's nothing a drag queen singing Beyonce can't fix. And now I'm home and back to reality. <laughs> so the breakdown, how can I explain this? You know, I think it basically just boils down to the respect of my time and the respect of my craft. You know, I'm definitely not like the most creative YouTuber or the best YouTuber, but I am the most honest, I feel, in every aspect of my life. And that includes working with brands that I personally use. And when people don't trust me to do my job, that's really annoying. When they second guess me, that's really annoying. And I just had a moment. What should be the question of the day? Since we are talking about brands and stuff and you saw how I worked today, um, I think the question of the Vlogmas should be, what do you stand for? And what is a brand that you think aligns with what you stand for and I think that may be a very like influencer question because that's something I have to think about um, every time a brand comes to work with me it's like do you stand for what I stand for but I think it's also good to know um, and good to think about that question because you know I feel like we are in a world of consumerism so it's really good to support brands that align with our beliefs you know so yeah that's it i'm gonna end this vlog before i another, have another meltdown so funny i told you guys two days ago what i want to achieve in december and it was to not have a mental breakdown and we are already in day three and like four of vlogmas and i've already had one so 
<laughs> let's hope that I got it out of the way and the rest of the month will be smooth sailing. But anyways, I'm Isha Dang. Thank you so much for watching this video. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.